Okay, this is the fun fly stick. Uh, it's essentially a tiny Van de Graaff generator, so this gets up to a charge, and it's used to make this thing fly. So you just uh, you turn it on, you can hear it charging up, and then this thing just actually it takes a second. There it goes, it flies. Okay, but there's other cool things you can do with it. First, let me show you this. Okay, so here I have two tapes. Uh, if you use these clear tapes like this, they actually can be come charged. So if you get two of them together and kind of pull them up together, and when you pull them apart, one will be positive and one will be negative. Let me put them on this stand right here just so we can uh, look at them. And so I've put one as a T and one as a L, top and lower. Okay, so I'm going to pull them apart. I'm going to put this one right here. Not perfect. They're both charged. They stick to your hand. And this one right here. I'll just hold this one. Okay, so here's the T-tape. Let's see what happens when I bring... I want to track that. See, that repels. But if I bring it next to this other one, see, it attracts. So there, this is charged oppositely of that one and the same as this one. And those two attract each other. So th these tapes work really well because you can do them when, even when it's humid uh, outside. They just don't last too long. Okay, how about another cool experiment? I'll pull these off. Here I have some paper. You see the little paper down there. Now watch what happens when I bring the uh, fun fly rod near the paper. So they're neutral paper. The electric charge on here polarizes this to make it attract. Once it touches, then the paper gets some same charge as the rod and repels. And so that's why they come up and back down. And I can do the same thing with this. Here's a, uh, this is a piece of aluminum foil. Uh, so let's see what happens when I bring that up. Okay, I think this one actually um, kind of can shoot some charges off. It didn't even touch and it got charged. You see that? Okay, but watch this. Okay, let me move over here. What if I put my hand on one side and touch it? So what's happening is when it touches my hand, it gets discharged, it tracks back to the thing, and the whole thing repeats over and over again. Okay, one more demo. I like this one. You, you would normally do this one with a, um, a faucet, but I'm not near the faucet. So here I have a stream of water. Can you see that? And I'm going to bring the fun fly rod near it. Let's do it even higher. So again, the water essentially does the same thing. It's neutral, but the way water molecules work, they can be attracted to a positive charge or a negative charge, and that pulls the whole stream off to the side. And you can do that with the sink. If you want to do that with the sink, you can actually even do, you can take um, something like this, a plastic, a PVC and, and rub it with plastic. That actually works pretty well. Hold it near a stream of water. You want the stream to be very, very thin and smooth, and you can get it to bend like that. Okay, so there you go.